Dartfish Video Analysis. Dartfish is the world's leading video analysis software. It is a tool that elite athletes use to highlight and target areas of weakness and develop them into strength. Stro Motion. Stro Motion is a very cool video enhancement. It allows athletes to see their movement unfold in time by compounding video images into a frame by frame sequence. This application is perfect for showing athletes what they can do at a given time as they progress in the motion. Stroke motion can be used in any sport or any physical activity. Side by side. Side by side is great for comparing two videos to one another. You can you can pick out trends, uh, mistakes, and weaknesses, and try to improve on them. One of the cool features about side by side is that you can sync up two cameras, uh, taping the same movement from different angles. For example, if you are long jumping and they have cameras set up in front of you and to the side of you. Uh, when you synchronize both the clips, you can see both angles at the same time. It's a really neat thing and you can get very good feedback from it. Simulcam. Simulcam is another great application to Dartfish that allows viewers to compare and contrast athletes' positions, styles, and uh, trajectories. Uh, through synchronizing and superimposing video clips. This allows you to recognize your mistakes, your habits, and your weaknesses so you can critique them and make them your strengths. Another really cool thing you can do with Simulcam is compare video with professional athletes. So say if you wanted to copy Michael Jordan's free throw exactly to the T, uh, it would be really easy to do so. Other analysis tools. Dartfish has many other analysis tools. Here we're going to take a look at the majority of them. Measuring tool. The measuring tool measures things on the video. In order to measure things, you must have a reference point. A lot of people use a five foot piece of tape to use as their reference mark, so later on, when they analyze the video, they can measure things. In this example, the hurdle is the reference point because you know the hurdle is 39 inches high. You can use this tool in any other sport as long as you have a reference point. Golf Club Tracer. The Golf Club Tracer traces exactly where the golf club goes. The path represented by the green color is the backswing and the yellow represents the downswing. This tool here is called the golfer's key positions. Uh, basically it's used to see where the golf club is at any given time. This is called the golfer's silhouette. This is a tool that keeps your posture consistent. The zooming in tool simply allows you to zoom in on an area of the video and as it plays, it also plays the zoomed in area. The timing tool is a great tool because you can start and stop at any given point. It displays on the screen in real time. This example is the timing of Alan Johnson's steps in between each of the 10 hurdles. The timing tool is used heavily in different analysis situations. The tracing tool. The tracing tool shows the tracing and the trajectory of the movement. In this video, the marker will track the bar and the trajectory will be shown. The tracing tool is great because you can see exactly what you're doing at a given point. Horizontal and vertical lines are mainly used for posture type analysis. In this particular analysis, they're measuring the head movement and body movement of the cyclist. 
angle tracking. This tool allows you to track the angle using any three given points. Angle tracking is great because you can show the athlete exactly what angle they're at. Many athletes learn by seeing 